Yeah. We should get Disney to buy us a house and put us all in a for real like life, two weeks. Real life. <laughs> Uh, Thomas Booby, welcome to Fun Kids. Thank so, you. Thomas, I need to say a huge thank you to you first. Last time you came on Fun Kids, um, you stole our breakfast show presenter's phone. Do you remember this? Yeah. Sean, he lost a forfeit to me, basically, Boo Boo. Um, <laughs> where the, the, the forfeit was the, the people from the lodge, this was Thomas was on at the time, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. took the phone and texted weird, strange messages to random people on his contact list. Yeah. So thank you very much because you've unsettled my good friend Sean and made him squirm for like the last three months. <laughs> so thank you a lot for that. I messaged, we went through his contacts, mm -hmm. I messaged girl. Oh, that I just said girl. Perfect. That's it. Oh, literally the yeah, name was a girl. Just girl. I wonder who. Just girl. Just go. I don't think he knows. No, 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 no. Which is why he's been squirming for three months. <laughs> <laughs> so thank you so much for that, by the way, Thomas. You're very uh, anyway, welcome. Here anytime. for Descendants 2. Um, Boo Boo, I remember the, the end of the last film, Descendants 1, everything was going fine. You know, all the villain kids, they were all happy. Um, what is Jay thinking as we move into the second film? As you move into the second movie, Jay is definitely, you know, he's loving his life in Ordon. I think he's settled there. He really is. He's found his place. He's found who he is. And I think he sees his future there. So um, coming into Descendants 2, you'll see that. And, and how was it kind of going back with, with your Descendants 1 family? They're all there. Uh, a couple of years later, you're filming this. How was it being back together? Oh, it was awesome. Being back with the gang, everyone was great. You know, it's even though we weren't filming in the in the in-between time, we saw each other sporadically, and you know, you see each other because of Descendants. So just being back on set just felt like we we're just going back home with each other, really. So. Uh, and Thomas, you, you're new to the cast. Harry Hook, uh, what's it like joining joining the family? Yeah, it was amazing. It was really. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, it was. It was. I mean, obviously, it's this. They were obviously such a well-established kind of family cast crew, uh, and obviously they're good relationships with each other so it was quite intimidating but no the guys were amazing they were so welcoming so lovely um and yeah it was an amazing experience uh, what's it like kind of playing the bad guy in a show full of villains mm. and bad guys what's that like for you i love it <laughs> yeah it's great it's so <laughs> fun yeah i i am um, yeah i always feel a bit weird saying that i love playing the bad guy but yeah. they're just always a lot more fun. Why are they more fun? What do you I do? don't know. They're just a bit... Well, Harry's a bit crazy. He's a bit hostile. He's yeah. quite unpredictable. I mean, I didn't even know what I was going to do next. And Kenny was amazing. He just let me have, like, free reign. Mm -hmm. um, so you kind of just go... Just go with it. Uh, and I feel it's a lot easier to kind of, like, immerse yourself in the character uh, as opposed to playing something that's kind of similar to you. You're yeah. completely... You're like, taken, out of, taken out of your own headspace your own self mm -hmm. um, and yeah it's just it's good fun and you, you get to I have to say wear a lot more exciting gear and clothes and facial makeup than the rest of them so that must be fun you've got a fully the eyeliner. Character. The eyeliner. The eyeliner. The eyeliner. <laughs> so Captain Hooks though is kind of one of the most famous villains in, in film and book history what was it like trying to make his son your own um it's, it was amazing I guess it's like a dream for 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 an actor to, to be given a bit of kind of of history and like you say like a father and uh, so many people have done Hook in the past and there, there's a book about it and stuff but to have this new character uh, a descendant from him it was was amazing so I, I really had and Kenny was amazing he let me have free reign over over creating this this new character and he said to me he wanted Harry Hook to be the the most evil villain in a hundred years of Disney. Dang. So I was like, yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna run with this bad boy. So uh, yeah, that's something you've got to do though. It's some, yeah, um, it's, it's some boots you want to do. <laughs> How did you start to even make that your own? There. How did you try and fill those boots of being the most evil Disney villain in a century? Um, I guess I kind of, I, I guess I drew it from. Uh, I think when when you have a character like that, is is a more complex character. So you can't just be always angry. And he has to be quite. It's scarier if he's like quite confident and quite charming, as well as that. Um, so I kind of combined those two together and kind of played about with it. And and Kenny kind of suggested kind of getting a kind of Mick Jagger swagger with, with a bit of Harry Styles. And I'm a massive fan of Heath Ledger, so uh, him in The Dark Knight, he was uh, quite influential in some of my decisions. 
Yeah, and then you start working on like characteristics and even like the walk, like the way I walk is kind of, uh, I really did, I did a bit of work on that just to kind of get it all right and flow naturally and um, yeah, it's all about kind of getting that balance and with the help of Kenny and with everyone else in the cast, yeah, I was Harry. <laughs> Let's kind of talk about the story then. Um, Boo Boo, what's the second Descendants about then? Because we start off and Mal, uh, she's got a great life but she's not loving it too much. Yeah, exactly. That's kind of the whole point. It's like the, the VKs, we've all come to really find our places in Ordon, except for Mal. And Mal is having a really, <laughs> well, she's having a really hard time. And uh, she just can't seem to get a grip on life. And she runs off. And so we have to go get her. We have to bring her back. Uh, we have to kind of be there for her, be the family that we become for her. So. And Thomas, what's it like now being, because with the Lodge and now this, you're properly part of the Disney family, mm. aren't you really? What's it like? Everyone wants to be a Disney star. What's it actually like being one? Good fun, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> it's really good fun. I mean, Disney's—they're uh, amazing. They're—they're they're really kind of caring and they look after us really well. Um, mm -hmm. And um, it's kind of nice for me as well because, like, the lodge was my first job. This was my second job, so it's a—it's nice to to join join the Disney family and kind of get gradually, gently introduced to the to the industry. Um, but no, yeah, it's, it's it's really really good fun. My little sister loves it. Okay. <laughs> she just tells all her friends. <laughs> is she um, is she a big a big singer along to the to the songs of these as well? In secret, she is. Yeah. Okay, right. She secret. knows all the words. She knows the rap. <laughs> she gives me a run for my money with the rap. Um, and obviously got to work with Kenny Ortega, uh, the mastermind behind the High School Musical films. What was it like doing a show, having him tell you what to do and how to act, how to sing? Well, Kenny, the great thing about Kenny is that. He never really tells you exactly, mm. you know what I mean? Yeah. He really, he casts you specifically in the role because what you bring to it, I feel like. And so he really trusts you in bringing the characters to life. Mm -hmm. um, and he's, his imagination, he'll, we'll be doing rehearsals and uh, we'll all think it's, you know, think it's good, the choreography's really great and everything. Then Kenny will walk in and he'll be like, um, why don't we do this instead? And he'll make one little change, and you're just like, oh, that's wow, so funny. that's I, what it is. <laughs> I always say that's why it's, it's well. like, uh, And then everyone's like, oh, that's why Kenny's Kenny. Kenny. He just can see things that the normal person does not see. <laughs> so that one is, yeah, that's exactly what I see. It's that's like, what he does. Because like, you'll be doing something, you'll be like, oh, this is really this good. Is really this good. Is, I'm proud of this. And you'll yeah. come in, and you'll be like, no. And I'm like, really? Okay, like, you're Kenny Ortega, I'll do what you <laughs> say, man. And then you do it, and you're like, that's well, fine. Yeah. you're the man. Yeah. <laughs> There's so much that comes with being in Descendants. Uh, earlier on today, I was on YouTube, and someone had made you all in The Sims. So, so oh, really? Yeah. That's cool. Yeah, it's, yeah, yeah. you can find it. It's good. That's um, okay. yeah. So that's a lot of fun. Well, uh, as Descendants characters. Yeah, Descendants characters. So you've got Dove in there. You've, you've got Evie, Sophia. You know, everyone's in there, just kind of chilling out in the house, seeing what happens. So you've got that going on. I, I also watch. Like we should do that. Yeah. We should get Disney to buy us a house and put us all in a for real like life, two weeks. Real life Sims. Yeah. <laughs> Who do you reckon would kind of be the boss of, of the whole house? You, you know, someone always rises to the top. One of the girls. Yeah, yeah. one of the girls for sure. <laughs> what, do you reckon, what, what job do you reckon you would get to do in the house? Would you be washer upper? Would you be cook? I'd going just on? be chilling with Boo Boo. Yeah. 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 yeah, that's cool. I was also watching earlier, uh, Boo Boo, you surprising people at Disneyland. Yes. Yeah, you, you were taking the photography. Photos. Yeah, yes. It, it's that incredible. was awesome. That, is that so was cool. actually really, really fun. I was really scared. I was like kind of nervous to do it. But so pretty much what happened was we're at Disneyland. <laughs> <laughs> and they're photographers at Disneyland. So they dressed me up as a photographer. <laughs> <laughs> and I was taking the Spider Man photos. So there's a Spider Man guy there, and the people would come up and they'd stand with Spider Man and be like, okay, ready? And I'd have the camera in front of my face and I'd take the photo, then I'd put it down, and the little girls were like, <gasps> Literally, and it was cool because I was actually videotaping the whole time, so I like videotaped their first reactions, and oh, it was really, really, so really cool. Cute. So, what's it like um, having such a huge fan base that's so dedicated and passionate as as the guys who follow Descendants? Oh, it's it's fantastic. Um, it really is something special. And the more the longer, uh, like the more Descendants goes on for, I feel like. The, the fan base grows even larger, like not just grows like in, in one sense, but it grows in the way of like 
there's adults that are watching this end, and yeah, yeah. like more guys are watching this end. And, um, more it's Scottish not, people as well. More Scottish people too. Yeah. It's really great. Our Scottish fan base is very strong. <laughs> 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 well, speaking of your fans, I've got a few questions actually. Uh, from the Fun Kids listeners, this is through Pop Jam. So Andrea Sonic said, so Andrea Sonic 2 oh, okay. says, what was your favourite scene to film? Definitely the fight scene. Yeah, there are, our fight scene was so much fun. Yeah, yeah we yeah. have a scene where we fight. Yeah, it's really fun. <laughs> and how is that done? Is it, are you, have you fully learned it before? Almost like a dance routine? Yeah, there, exactly. There's no, what would happen if you went kind of off book during the fight scene? Someone would get hurt. Yeah, we get hurt. Yeah, yeah. Hurt <laughs> that's not a good idea. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's very much it's like choreography. Yeah, we knew exactly what we were kind of getting into, and it was pretty cool because the stunt team taught us how to fence and everything like that. But then they let us choreograph ourselves pretty mm. much. Oh, so yeah. we got to put together a fight scene, which was really really fun. Yeah. And how do you how do you start doing that? Who has the ideas to do what? I I don't know. I feel like we both came up with it. Oh. Yeah, or him. Passing the button. Yeah, right, this, this comes from 21 humans. He's got a question for both of you. 21 uh, humans. Where does that where come does from? That come I want to know. It's a new world order. <laughs> so we, we've cracked the new world order right here. Uh, Thomas, what was it like being born? Oh, I love this. You've been in like a massive Disney film. What was it like being born in Scotland? <laughs> I, uh, where are they from? <laughs> I've never been born anywhere anywhere else, yeah, so yeah, what was it like? I don't know how to. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it was. I, I would say normal, but everyone's normal mm-hmm. is different. So um, it was. It was fantastic. I loved it's it. Like hanging out with William Wallace. Hanging out with like, William yeah, and Robert, Robert, Robert yeah. Bruce, Sean Connery. Sean Connery Castle, yes. well, there you go, <laughs> James yeah, it was Barnum amazing. <laughs> it was absolutely this is great. One for <laughs> Um, we'll disregard the fact that Thomas is sat right next to you. Who was your best friend on set? <laughs> Apart from me. Apart from Thomas. Yeah. Um, dude. <laughs> the dog. Doing the dog? Yeah. Yeah. Dude, yeah. yeah. Roaming around there Yeah, as there well. was actually two dogs that played, two, yeah. dude. One was a girl. And one was really scary. Yeah, yeah with, the, <laughs> with the bite. This is quite a cool they're question. Cute. They're cute dogs. Uh, Slime a dude T. Oh, there it is. These names, eh? Oh, uh, it uh, says, what was the strangest <laughs> talent that someone had, one of your cast members had on set? Um, well, Dove can do really good impersonations of the minions. Okay. That's Ooh. funny. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like, oddly, like, actually, like, yeah. movie quality <laughs> level, like, impersonation. <laughs> I always care to do it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it literally sounds like the movie. <laughs> yeah, she's got really good impressions of that. Cameron, can Cameron do anything? You, uh, like, you can like break dance. Cameron's, stuff. yeah, Cameron's an incredible dancer. Yeah. Like, yeah. He's actually amazing. Oh, I prefer the minion impressions if I'm honest. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't we right, teach this, Cameron how to do This is the last year. <laughs> or even better, teach Dove how to break dance. <laughs> <laughs> or Dove how to break dance. No, Dove. Dove. Oh, Dove how to yeah, break dance. Yeah, so we'll yeah. teach her to break dance and then she can do the minions impressions and, and we can like sell her. Why are we still here? <laughs> right, this know. is the last get one. The and it's good because it ties up and get their admin done as well. Okay. This is from Unicorn Sparkle Rainbow who says. <laughs> Who says, That's amazing. I these are the that. listeners. Let's just. Who says, when's it coming out so we can actually see it? Oh, it comes out on the 20th. Yeah. Yes, yeah. of October. It comes out in October. Yes, yeah, October 20th. Sometime. Is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Something like that. So, yes. October 20th. And uh, on Disney Channel and Disney Lifestyle. <laughs> there we go. Nice, nice lovely note. Did, when did you, did you hear that? The style. I didn't hear that. Perfect note. Thanks. Perfect. Thank anyway, you. thank you so much for coming on Fun Kids. Cheers, guys. Thank you. And thank you for all your cool, uh, all your cool yes, names, your usernames. You. They're amazing. I have Inspiring. To, I need to be more creative. I need to write them all down. Thanks. <laughs>